Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World Evolution Return to Jurassic World and yes we are on Isla Muerta once again and we did some changes off screen such as on this um, fence on the outside I thought it would give it a more um, lab sort of look as if this was one big building you know sort of thing I want to do and if we recall, oh, yep, the body disappeared. Bubbles lost his friend, and now he's alone, fighting off the two raptors. For this episode, we're going to be working on this section right here, which is the remaining part of the science area for Dr. Wu. And then maybe we might get started on this area. Now remember, of course, please leave um, dinosaur suggestions in the comments below, as well as names for any, because... Can't name them all myself. So, first, wait, what are we gonna do? No, Bubbles is gonna die. And Bubbles is dead. Killed by the big one. You know, if this was a paleontologically accurate battle, this thing would be 10 feet tall, and you would probably be dead. Good thing it's not like a tourist. But our star rating has gone down. Wait, why did I put a path here? Boost it up here. Nobody can see what we're working on. So, yes, I remember over here was going to be sort of like um, a car test, vehicle testing. So we need to first set up... Oh yes, we need to set up an expedition unit because that was the one that we didn't have, so... We'll just put up half. No, not you. We'll put you here. The fat. And then here. And then, well, we shall go so on and so forth. Okay, guys, we just froze for a second there. A little dangerous. But now we need to work on. So first, let me just remember how big these guys are. Okay, we'll probably have um three lined up, here, or maybe four, like one back here, and then three lining up here, and then like sort of a an enclosure line that'll be for testing them. We'll put like a carnivore in here, or maybe multiples. Probably just one though. Now remember, these dinosaurs are not going to be named because they're like test dinosaurs, those kind of things. And then what was I going to do on the other side? Think, uh, hold on. First we need to line up, no, we need to go this way. So let's go as about here, then we'll go past, oh, you've done it again, Austin. Three more. Now let's just make sure that that is fine. Excellent work. Alright, so now we need another one. Oh, it's a goat. Might as well just release those raptors out here just to get rid of you frickin' goats. The dinosaur. Oh, it's a jeep. Alright. And boom. No, wait, wait, I need to put the Yes, yes, Austin. Foo. You need to put this. Uh, let's put it a little closer. Right. Very good, excellent work. And then we'll go there. And then... And we got the Marachi Band. Oh, we're making a profit somehow. Next one... Oh, itch.
Come on. Alright, so we have to put one sideways, but we could, that could mean we put like more operations like this go. No. Can we maybe put them on this side, please? Come on, come on, I know you want to, come on. Okay, we'll put it, no, we can have a facility, some facilities lined up here, and then the enclosures, yes, yes, yes. So we'll have an L shape of um, facilities, so like the paleobotany, the um, science and security um, facilities, and then maybe a AC, another ACU. And then here, we'll put... We'll go here. What'd you do? Fine, we'll rip it off. Not quite yet. So we're in the middle of the storm, things are breaking apart, and we've got to fix them. Hit the brakes! Because we're going to crash into the trees. And we don't want to crash into the trees, we want to crash into people. And, uh, uh, well, which is good. Maybe I shouldn't have put these walls, because now I don't know which way to go. Uh, just keep going this way. And, um, uh, oh god. Oh no, I'm gonna hit the wall again. Oh, god damn it. Keep the Ah, there's the exit. I'm free! Let's get out of here, guys. We're free! Freedom! Cut to, like, keep saying, fence broken, and I'd be like, god damn it. The big one is escape. Ah, speak of the devil, it broke out. Hold on, guys. We gotta make a quick turn. Detour, guys. Ugh, where's the, where's the bloody exit? Ugh. And oh, there it is. Please tell me that. Uh, it's somewhere. Uh, I've got. Aw, oh, look at them. They're all so calm and relaxed. And then we get over here, and there's uh, running and screaming. Because um, there's one right. There's one right. Ah, yes. Very good. Stay still. Stay still. It's fine. No, don't go up in the jungle. I can't. Ah, oh, shh. Come on. Come to me, you little... Oh boy, he's coming. Yay. And there's one. And he's gonna kill some. Oh, just before he's trying to... Where's the other one? Duh. It's fine, guys. It's, it's just a test run of our security measures. Besides, most of your sciences. Stop breaking our fences, buddy. Where'd you go? <sighs> Bugger. Oh, oh, found him. Under no, 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 no. You just want to... Oh, balls. Stay still. Yes, eat someone and then we can, um, tranquilize you in your enemy. Uh, or run. Yes, gotcha! 
Ah, but you will eat someone. It's okay. It's a guest. They shouldn't be here anyway. It's what happens when they don't go where they go where they don't belong. They get eaten. So guests at, Jurassic, at real Jurassic Worlds, please know if you go into restricted sections when you know you're not supposed to be in there, you will be, you will be sentenced to become food of the Velociraptors. It's, it's nothing personal, it's just dumb business. Lord business. And if you don't um, know that, ref, what reference that is for, um, well then you've never seen the Lego movie. All right. Well, we're at half a star, guys. It's it's over. Close the park down. It's over. We've had our f we've had our first um death of a dinosaur on this island, and we've also had our first human death on this island. It's kind of fitting, after all. This is type this island. Its name literally means the island of the dead. Just in case you didn't know that. Oh, no, no, no. Yes. And there we go. We have the first area done, which this one will be literally, um, there'll be a pathway around here, probably, then a pathway around there. Unless, do I want to connect it? Yeah, I'll connect it there. So let's demolish this fence. And then this one. Oh no, not the path. Not the path, Austin. You've ruined it. It's over, guys. But what we do want to do... Should we just have it... Yeah, there's enough space there. We can um, put it like uh, this. Just going straight all the way. At least until I say we've got enough. And then we'll have a fence on the outside. Which means I should just put a... And then I'll have a gate over here into the enclosures that go into here. Uh, I wish I could flatten this even more, but that is the end. So we might have to cut into, like... Because it's just going to be a strip here. So... Yeah, whatever. And... See that OCD is killing me, it's not killing me, we gotta go this way. And boom. Do a one sideways. Nah, it's a sort of a display thing. You know, the only um sort of facility thing that you could have is like a guest area, like for guests to, that you would want them to see is the greenhouses because like I know a lot of people who who are dinosaur fans who would really want to like see all these. They would literally be like, where's the paleobotany? I'd be one of those people too, because I'd love to see the different kinds of paleobotany. After all, be a huge, um, it'd technically be an even bigger development in our world than recreating dinosaurs, because of the simple fact that if we were able to recreate them, could they have medicines or even 
nutritional benefits to humans. Just things like that, you know. And I'm not saying if we recreated um, fossilized plants, we would just eat them. That would be literally the dumbest thing you could do. I mean, like, the possibilities with them are endless. Okay, guys, so we have the um, lineup of facilities. So first I'm going to make, like, the um, sort of jeep area, which is going to be demolished. And what carnivore should we have? I want to ma make it a larger carnivore. Um, let's take a look anyway. Yeah, let's see. Um, maybe Allosaurus or... Carnotaurus would be a good one. Or I'm thinking either Carnotaurus or Giganotosaurus. So, but what should we do? I do want to do... I'm thinking also we could do... Maybe even Baryon? I think we'll do Baryonyx. Let's do... Because we can have two of them. I mean, we could have two of all three of them. But not only would this help with my own... We can have Giga or Carno in, like, one of the other exhibits as well. Well, let's make the enclosure here quickly. We're gonna have to put some water in. So, like, maybe it could be, like, there's a section that's, like, testing the, um... Testing the, um... Durability and the environment. So, yeah, I'm gonna actually, um... Probably, um... Do... Yeah, that's what I can do. I can split this into two sections. Like, I'll have a smaller section right here, which will have a gate that's always open because we need to deal with the water requirements of the Baryonyx. Remember that, guys. A gate in the middle, and we'll have, um... Water it all up. God, the frame rates. What's going on? I've barely done anything. And then we'll have like a little water area here. And then what I'll do is like a small little row, which hopefully we can put the gate in. I don't have to. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's um, delete some of that water for the Baryonyx. The Heavy Claw. Even though it doesn't have it for some reason, which I don't actually know why it does, why they took that out of it. It's like one of its most unique features. Wouldn't it be so cool if like we couldn't actually have them like together? Like what? Like I don't mean just by like they think of each other as different creatures because they have different skins. Even though that kind of would make sense in this case. Um, but just imagine if, like, en route to collect the asset. with each, um, skin and stuff, you needed, um, different requirements. So, for example, for the, um, wetland skins, you needed your dinosaur, that dinosaur would need more, um, water requirements, received. less, um, grassland, maybe the same amount of forest compared to the basic. I just love that. It'd make it looks, it'd make it, um, so much more alive, like, as if an after effect. And then the other one will be all defense. So that means. And then there. Though realistically, if you modify a dinosaur to have its highest defense and face it off against something that's modified for highest attack, especially if it's the same dinosaur, then it will, um, the defense one will always win. I've tested it with both Indominus Rex and Indoraptor. Then we have to do Snake on this guy. And boom. So yeah, realistically because of this... Oh wait, no, we, we don't want both of them being, um... We want you to have a skin. Now, is he? 
Oh yeah, he's more expensive. So this one may fail, and I think I'm gonna go with wetland. Four hundred. All right. So hopefully you don't fail. All right. So we can split this up into one section for. No, we need to b definitely make it bigger. We need to make sure that we forced it up because we can't have the public seeing our, well, our secrets. The secrets of Dr. Wu. No, no, just joking, guys, because, well, not joking for forcing it up, which, why don't we just do that now? have this space as like another one so like maybe um we can actually have this as like sort of two so like testing um fences so like I have an idea guys so we'll go Or that has just been recently um, teased to be joining the Jurassic franchise for Jurassic World Dominion. The Giganotosaurus. I'm, I actually really hope it's like this design because I love it. It's one of my top. Which. I may be doing a sort of top 10 video for my um, favorite um, Jurassic World Evolution dinosaurs. Maybe. I'm probably not going to do like my top 10, um, I mean bottom 10 or top 10 worst because like there isn't like a bad, there aren't like the bad dinosaurs. Because if they are, they're going to be like things like Notosaurus or Pelta, because of the fact that those guys can literally only be with themselves. Um, yeah, we're going to um, be strategic and um, sedate the raptors, because I don't want them breaking out. That's a bad idea. The Giga is fine. There's nothing. Well, actually, he's over here, so... Scratch that, that's a bad idea too. Heading to pick up the asset. Has been updated. Storm warnings just And we're almost at two stars, guys, which means we may actually get the five stars we want on this. What should we have here, guys? Should we have something maybe Mitrichanthosaurus? And please Velociraptors don't break out again. My insurance rates are far too low right now. But what should I do over here? Actually, I don't think I need anything right here. This can just be like, um, bonus space, so like, just let it breathe. They're not on Oh. Uh, I think it's starting to come down, I think. Yep, they're going up. They're good. They said good. Wait. Path it. Balls. I forgot about... God damn it. And now we need a path. That's literally going to just connect. And nothing broke out because, um, 
the two big worries were knocked out cold. I thought of it. Please tell me you're. Oh my god, guys. We're literally on the brink of destruction. Speed. Duh. 28 miles per hour. Oh my god, it almost broke through the fence. Oh, this one's. Yeah, so like literally, if I put even a tree more, which. Just because this one's so lonely, I kind of like it here. If, like, we just put one more tree in, one more, they would explode with rage. Come on, where is it? Where is it? Oh, careful, guys. We got a dreaming puppy. So you might hear some woofs or snorts. What the bloody hell is it? Uh, dude, you're thirsty. To... Uh, let's try this again, guys. Where is he? Where is she? Oh, I think it's right... Yeah, it's right there. Let's have both of them as vivid. And then these ones... Can just have um lifespan added to them because they're not um being they're just being tested for um the modification the genetic modification so vibrant which means we're gonna want a little bit of water here and then we want oh we're making half a million dollars now which is technically how is that possible? How are we making more money on this island right now than on Isla Matanceros, which is a fully five-star... That makes... That's so weird to me, guys. So, once those guys are done, and we place them in there, it'll be... Oh. <laughs> This Giga. Um, Gumbo. And then we'll name one of the Baryon. This Baryonyx. Group. Groups. And if you have name suggestions for this Baryonyx or the um, other Giga, um, this one, as well as the Metricanthosauruses, please leave comments. You can also um, name this Velociraptor if you want. And also, if you have any other dinosaur re um, requests, go right ahead and leave them. We already have... Um, Technically, we'll technically have three because I know where I'm gonna put Dilophosaurus for this island. So, in the next episode, we're gonna work on this guest area, and then probably in the episode after that, will be this guest area, and then we'll be done. Oh, and they're almost done, so we'll cut back to when they're done. And Jesus, we have spent almost 30 million dollars already on this island guys we gotta make the um revenue back and we're literally getting them um, how much money are we getting from people entering okay ticket sales are basically where all of our money is look at that face the face of evil and cuteness the uh, i didn't say it and, and this is where the... Oh, wait, no, this car is a little bit longer than the others. Okay, why is it... Uh-oh. Oh, God. Well. Okay. Come on, let's... Oh, wait, was it... what was that? Oh, they are done. The Metriacanthosauruses are done. And once we release the first one, we're gonna end it, guys. So, if you've enjoyed this video, leave
leave a like, and if you want to join the hunt, hit the subscribe button. Be safe, and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye